Hello everyone, Silvermoon here with another, with a re-recording of episode 51 of Skylanders Fire's Adventure. In the last part, we got to this point in episode, in chapter 13, the Goo Factory. In this episode, we're going to fin refinish it. Now, I've already gone through this chapter and already collected all of the, all of the treasure chests and everything, so you won't see I'll try my best to remember where they are and point out where they were, but no guarantees my memory will be perfect. Now, now I'm being way more smart with the about the claw trolls this time. The trollverines, I guess. Yes, I was able to defeat them without flame or dying this time. And as I mentioned, it's a good thing that there isn't a Skylanders Nuzlocke yet, and if there ever is one, I am not participating. I believe there might have been... Yeah, this was where Camo's Soul Gem was, so be sure to pick that up. And over here is where the Mega Bombs are, obviously. You can break all these up for more treasure. can't break this one apart, unfortunately. Now in order to get continue, you'll need to break down the wall. And the Mega Bombs are on a timer, by the way. Uh, oh, sorry, I didn't mean to... We need to roll a Mega Bomb down there. Sorry, I, I skipped the cut... Skipped it, even though I... You haven't seen it yet. So, so roll it down, and it will automatically roll down hills. And as it gets here... BOOM! Great! Babu's ghost! What a blast! <laughs> okay, he's crazy. He's now, crazy. If you can just find one more bomb and roll it back to the captain, we can go right on through the factories. Yep. Factories, alright. So walk right back up here and there's another bomb. I believe the mega bombs are on a timer, don't quote me on that though. So, uh, so, I'll try to collect all the treasure along the way, but, like I said, so, just roll it on down. Skylanders of the Earth so, we're back to Sandbank Hill. We can show. actually take a shortcut, but... You can also steamroll over some enemies by going and get some treasure by going down this way. I missed all this treasure last time because cutscenes apparently despawn treasure. Yeah, anyways, last episode I kinda allowed Flea Slinger to die because I was stupid as these close those claw trolls. And Flame Slinger levels up, speaking of which. So uh ball pushing physics at its worst. Boom! Not a headshot. And you said it wrong, Rizzo. Now it's You're not a demo, like true that. demo man if you're not saying it right. There are three goo factories. Raise the flags at each one to signal the capture. Then we can secure the goo. Good luck, soldier. Good luck. All right, now we have to head in here, raise all the flags. Skylanders of the tech element are stronger. I believe there there actually was might have been a treasure chest somewhere around here. Fire Elemental Skylander Gate. You walk through here. And you have this block pushing puzzle. You push the blocks in order to t get to that teleporter to get. Yes, you get a treasure chest in here. And you also walk across there, the boxes to get there to get that, that other hat. I'm skipping on this area because I've already gone through it, but I just told you what you needed to know, so. Skylanders of the tech element are stronger in this zone. But say we switch off Flame Slinger. And swap in Slam Bam. 
Yes, slam him of all guys. Marissa, nope. Yep. Oh, follow me, Claw Troll. Apparently, Slam Bam can break through enemy guards. Bomb! Bombs! Holy sh! Can't really quote that properly. Trying to make be more conservative for a younger audience. Those big wrenches are very worth picking up. Of course, you need to keep shaking the Wii Remote or not, and not step out of the zone, otherwise... Otherwise, you'll stop raising the flag. And Slam Man's being a real powerhouse as usual. What else would you expect from a Yeti with four muscular arms? I believe the last treasure chest was somewhere somewhere in this area. Unless I it was in, uh, I believe it actually was off in the, behind the gate. Of course, rocket imps. And Slam Bam levels up. Nice. So let's swap them out. I'm being completely random now with my Skylander choices. <laughs> Blast Radius for the win! Uh, no, no, don't fall off! Ugh. Oh well, no big loss. It's a, not a very far walk. But at least this time I'll be able to show the cutscene without going over the time limit. Hidden treasure, alright. Alright. Oh goody, a tank. TANK! Rocket launchers are good for taking out tanks. Just like Jay always says. Uh, I'm saying that a bit too much, methinks. And all the flags are raised. Thank you, Skylander. We've secured the factories, but the trolls are certain to retaliate. Let's hurry up and get this goo back to the general. He'll be expecting it. Yep, I think he will. And into the cannon with us. Oh wait, is it? Spoiler alert, there's a cannon there. What is it with this? What is it with this game and wanting to make us into human cannonballs? The green goo of Primordia, made from the fossils of vast prehistoric explodosaurs. It explodosaurs sounds power. interesting. How did they? Why did they even evolve the capability to explode? Or I shouldn't say that really because I don't know what they are. If 
If it was a real dinosaur, excuse me for saying that. And it fills up with the green goo, and that's about the only change. And this is where my current knowledge of the game actually ends. Yes, this is as far as I got in my other file of the game. They'll be blind from here on out. Glowing green goo After acquired. the completion of this level, now I mean. Now we need the eternal tech source. I don't suppose your military intelligence has found out where it is. Don't insult me, son. Of course we have. Intel says that the trolls have the eternal tech source hidden in their base. Unfortunately, they've already been using it to develop a slew of new weapons. That's why I'm coming along for support. Oh, Are what can you, you ready, do? Soldier? Well, we will be traveling to the battlefield in the next episode. Sorry for the shortness of this episode, but if you like this part, subscribe, comment, thumbs up, whatever you'd like to do to support this channel. And tell your friends, too, like I've been saying, because a good video is best shared with friends. Thanks for watching, and see you guys next time.